When the leaders of the Open Golf Championship reached this, the 13th hole, Jordan Spieth's mind was absolutely scrambled by his own omission. This is the young sporting hero who had blown a lead in the Masters last year. And instead of hitting his drive to this nice bit of fairway to our cameraman's right, the ball went more than 100 yards offline down this slope. I'll show you roughly where the ball ended up. This is just one from the driving range over here. And Spee's ball ended up deep in a bush like that. You can see how I almost lost my footing. Imagine Spieth trying to play a shot to a green more than 200 yards that way to stay in the hunt for the claret jug. He kept his head, and because he knows the rules of golf so well, saying later it's because he normally isn't such an accurate driver of the ball, he realized that he could take a drop, pick the ball up at the cost of one stroke, and drop the ball as far back that way as he wanted to go, keeping this point between there and the hole. And here's the really smart bit. He asked the rules officials, is this the driving range where the players practice before their rounds out of bounds? The officials said no, so that's when Spieth hatched his plan. Normally Spieth would have dropped the ball here, but he couldn't because of these equipment trucks, so he got a free drop, relief from that immovable temporary obstruction. And the ball was dropped on the driving range here. This is the divot Spieth made when he hit towards the green, a bogey, just one drop shot when it could have been much, much worse. And he went on to lift the claret jug for the first time in his illustrious career. Alex Thomas, CNN, Royal Birkdale.